grams. Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi my name is Maureen and I make lifestyle content while living on Sandoval as well as fashion, travel, and faith related content. So as you can tell by this title, this video is a little different. It's accessorizing my car with me. So all the items that I'm going to show you guys, I did get on Amazon. I got a new car within the last couple of months. So it was time to get some new items to put in that car. I thought it'd be easier to film it in my house than in my car, but I'll show you some clips of things that are already in there. Without further ado, let's just get right into the haul. So the first item that I have to show you guys is kind of this little car mount to put my phone. So this is what it looks like. You can kind of suction that onto the windshield, put the phone in it. So another way to hold up my phone if that's something that I want to do. So like I said earlier, all of these items are from Amazon and I'll have them linked down below on my Amazon storefront. I'll have like a whole section on like car accessories. Amazon, I bought all this with my own money. All opinions are my own, but just wanted to get that out of the way so you guys are aware of that. So the next item that I have to show you guys are car pocket organizers. So it's a great way to put them in between your seats. Let me just show you what that looks like. You put these in between your seats so you can put any important documents, anything that you want here. It's also a great way to kind of like a catch all so you're not losing things in between your seats. So of course, I'm gonna put this in the front in between those two seats. Next, I have a car freshener. So this is just the lavender version of them that you can clip into your car. Purple is my favorite color and I do love the lavender scent. So these will come in handy. And so I'm excited to use these and keep my car smelling clean and fresh. Next, I bought this dust cleaning gel, which I thought was like the most interesting thing of all. So I'm gonna keep this in the front. So what you do is, I'm not gonna open it, but it's like a gel, you can kind of see it here. And that's the brand, I got it in the color pink because I do love pink. And so you just kind of use it on different areas of the car where you see little bits of dust and you can just kind of wipe it over it and it collects the dust. So really great little invention there. I do love keeping my car very clean. So I'm happy to have this item. Next, which I thought was really important was a first aid kit. So you can see that here. I'm also gonna put this in like my front little console area. Let me see if I can open it. I don't, I wanna show it, but I don't want things to fall out. So just different first aid items, little Q-tips, little like gauze tape, if you will, safety pins, band-aids, all of that type of thing. So like sterilization pads, all of that. So I thought that would be great to have in the car because you never know when you're gonna need it. I also bought this little like car organizer that is also black. And I just think it's good to put all of your important documents in here that you might be carrying around with you in your car. So little folders there, I just thought this was good to have so there's no like loose paperwork in your car or any other important items that you might have. So that is what that looks like. Next, I wanted to get like a new lanyard because I feel like the one that I've had, I've had for a very long time and it's getting kind of old. So I thought it was good to replace those. So here's like a little lanyard here, like a little keychain holder. This is Lily Pulitzer, little seashell, cute little pattern here. I like this pattern a lot. My dog Molly has a collar that is also in that same pattern. And then same with this. So this is also a lanyard so I can put my keys on that as well. So I can separate like my car keys and then like my house keys, things like that. So also that same pattern again. Focus. So I like this pattern and I'm excited to use that. I also have this little M. So I already have this as well for my keys, but I decided to get a new one because my other one I've had since I was in college. So that's been a while for me since I've been in college. And it's getting a little beat up, so I decided to get a new one that is also Lily Pulitzer. It's a little bit different of a pattern, but I also have, which is funny, another dog collar for Molly that is this pattern. But M for morning, so excited about that. Another important item to have if you don't have in your car, I would highly recommend having it, is like a roadside emergency kit. Uh, so like I said, got this on Amazon as well. All this stuff is linked down below. But you never know when you're gonna need this and it's 
better to be over prepared in these types of situations than under prepared. That is everything in there. Like I said, I do have that listed on the storefront so you'll be able to see like all of the items in there. So I don't have to like take everything out because I want to keep it organized. Very good to have. I'm someone who's definitely a type A person and planning for all circumstances. And especially after going through a category five hurricane, I live on Sanibel Island that was affected by Hurricane Ian. I just think it's really important to have emergency essentials and to always be prepared. So the last two items I'll have to show you guys, I'll just put up a little clip here so you can see in my car. So there is in the back seat since I have two dogs. I like to keep my car as clean as possible. So I do have that little seat cover that you'll see. And then you'll also see that I have like a little dog, if you will, like harness or seat belt. I think it's really important in your car that if you have your dogs that they're not just like going loose and I know most people do that but for safety reasons it's good to have that kind of extra seat belt if you will for them so it just attaches to the back of their harness they have plenty of room to like sit lay down walk around but if you are in an accident at some point you don't want your dogs flying through the windshield or anything like that you want them to be safe that is something that I've implemented and put into all of my cars as well, I lost my other ones when I went through Hurricane Ian and I lost my car, so it's time to replace those. That is what I have in there and that will also, like I said, be linked on that Amazon storefront. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have any of these items or what other things you think I need in my car that are important to have. Make sure to comment that down below and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my content. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye everyone.